I'd already written two books, two and a half books on Pakistan previously. So when Scribner and Simon Schuster asked me to do a new book, I had to think what aspect of Pakistan did I want to cover, uh, which needed to be covered historically and which is very rarely written about at length. And I decided suddenly uh, that what needed to be done was a discussion of the relationship between Pakistan and the United States over the last 50 years. It's been a long relationship and essentially the relationship has not been good for Pakistan. Whether it's been good for the United States, we don't know. That is for them to judge. In my opinion, not. Because what happened on 9-11 came straight out of the US relationship with Pakistan and using Pakistan as a Cold War pawn. So this book, The Duel, has a subtitle, which is very important, Pakistan on the Flight Path of American Power. That This is a country whose elite willingly sold itself to the United States and said, our future lies with Washington, nowhere else, and we will do its bidding. This was not popular for the country. Uh, it was not popular with the people. And every time people protested, the military came in. So the core argument of the book is that in Pakistan, the United States has built up the armed forces, armed them, funded them because they see them as the only stable instrument in the country which can do their bidding. And the book takes you through the history of this uh, relationship with its sort of entertaining sides, but also with, with its sinister sides, that the Al-Qaeda group, for instance, and 9-11 grew directly out of the US-Pakistan relationship in the 80s, and nine, early 90s, when they were fighting the Cold War enemy, the Soviet Union, and the occupation of Afghanistan by that country, and they built these people up. So it's not a pleasant history, but at the same time, it's an important history to understand if lessons are going to be learned. And Pakistan is a country which not many people know about, especially in the United States. There's very little knowledge of what Pakistan is. Uh, for most people, it's a country run by a lot of bearded guys with bombs. And this is far from the truth. Uh, so the book is an attempt to explain the country and what has happened to it and the responsibilities both of the Pakistani elite and, of course, the United States of America. On the other hand, I have to say that I didn't write this book like I used to write 20 years ago, you know, uh, as a fierce uh, polemic. It's a book which I wrote just simply to tell the truth, because in the times in which we live, by and large, it's difficult to uncover the tooth, uh, truth. The media gives very limited reports of a country and only in times of crisis. So this is a book which anyone can read if they want to know what is going on in that part of the world and why it's becoming more dangerous.